Hey there, Survivors. Cougar here with a quick tutorial on how to download and install mods specifically for the Planet Crafter. But you can find mods for all kinds of games at Nexus Mods. Nexus is a free mod distribution site that's been around for more than a decade. It's trusted by mod creators and users alike. First thing you're going to need to do is create a Nexus profile. Nexus will not ask you for any credit card or payment information unless you choose to upgrade to a premium membership. It just needs some login information so that it can keep track of which mods you've downloaded and tell you if there's been an update to one of your mods so that you can get the newest version. Once you've created a profile, the first mod you're going to want to grab is the Bepin X Unity Installer. BepinX is a standard mod manager used by many, many games. As of May 2022, it's located at nexusmods.com site mods287. Now we're going to click the manual download button on the far right. This will offer you a slow download option or a fast download option for premium users. Again, the premium users are the ones who are paying for that fast download. The download will eventually appear in your downloads folder. Use your preferred zip extractor to extract it. I use 7-zip. Now we're going to copy the extracted Bepin X installer and navigate to our game folder, which is in my case, C, Program Files, x86, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, The Planet Crafter. Paste the Bepin X installer in there and run it. This will create a BepinX folder in the game folder. Open up the BepinX folder and then open the plugins folder. This is where we're going to drop the .dll file, which is the mod, once we've downloaded it. Now we go back to Nexus and find a mod that we want to use, like the Craft from Containers mod. Again, use the manual download option. That is the free download option. Once it's downloaded, extract it using 7-zip or whatever you want. And copy the .dll file it creates and paste it into the BepinX plugins folder. And that's it. You should be good to go. Just a quick note that some mods, when you extract them, they will create a folder with the .dll file inside. All you need is the .dll file. All you need to copy is the .dll file, drop that into the BepinX plugins folder, and you should be good to go. Let me know if you have any questions, but that should do it. Cougar out.